I'll show you two different ways that you can find a Z multiplier for a 90% confidence interval. First, I'll use stat key and then I'll do the same thing in mini tab express. In stat key, we're going to construct a Z distribution. That is a normal distribution. It's the default in stat key, mean of zero, standard deviation of one. For a 90% confidence interval, we need the Z values that separate the middle 90% from the outer 10%. So I'll select two tail. The default is 95%, but I can change that to 0.90. Here, the Z values that separate the middle 90% from the outer 10% are plus and minus 1.645. I'll take you to Minitab Express now to show you how you could also find that here. Um, under statistics, we'll make a distribution plot to display a probability. Again, the default is a Z distribution. It's a normal distribution with a mean of zero, standard deviation of one. We have a specified probability so we have 90% in the middle, which means that there's 10% on the tails and it's split equally. So the area in the tails, we would say is 0 0.10. Minitab Express will divide that by two and put 5% on the left, 5% on the right. And again, our Z multiplier will be plus and minus 1.64485.